Hi guys, welcome to Coach's Corner. I'm Jimmy Todorowski, one of the PT trainers here, and I'm gonna go through the correct form of doing a kettlebell swing. Now, a lot of, over the years, I've seen a lot of people do this exercise incorrectly. They'll do it more like a squat movement with knees, like bending the knees too much, which is fine, but the proper way to do it, you wanna have a bit more hip flexion and less bending of the knees. So I'll just turn sideways. A lot of times you'll see people doing the kettlebell swing like that. That's way too much bending the knees. So what you want to do is have hip, a lot more hip flexion and knees only slightly bent. So, so you want that kettlebell nice and tight under your glutes, straight arms. I'm going to flex a lot more in the hips. And at the top of the movement, you're going to really squeeze your hamstrings and glutes. See my legs are only slightly bent and I'll flex in more in the hips. Do a couple of more and forward. So you want to swing that kettlebell right under your glutes just at this point here. So swing and then flex. Swing and then hip flex. All right, so kettlebell swing is not only good for burning calories, but also it involves a lot of different muscle groups in your posterior and anterior chain. So you've got your shoulders, hamstrings, glutes and lower back. So it's a definitely an exercise you should include in your regime.